to Alan Day uh, outside of the top five. If Ercoli wins, will be enough to swing the title in favour of Gianmarco Ercoli. Let's see if it can happen. It's Alan Day with a nose ahead into the first couple of corners, but Giorgio Maggi just about holds on, although it's still side by side between the two of them. Who's going to have the lead? It could be Alan Day. Giorgio Maggi, though, resolutely around the outside. What's Ercoli going to do here? He's got a nose to the inside of Alan Day. And he's got the inside line, but he's slightly overstepped the mark there. Oh, and contact between the two of them. It's happened immediately on lap number one. And that's dropped Alan Day as far down the order as fifth place. And it could drop him further because he got very, very loose there, trying to get the car back onto the racing surface. The fracasso. NASCAR GP Grobnik has provided some brilliant racing so far on Championship Deciding Sunday. Right now, Alan Day is doing enough, even though Gianmarco Ercoli is our race leader. And Giorgio Maggi might be about to steal that race lead away, but contact between the two of them and into a spin goes Gianmarco Ercoli. Oh, goodness me. Well, that's decided the championship. Liam Hazeman's off as well. But with Gianmarco Ercoli spinning out to the back of the order, that sets things up wonderfully for Alan Day to secure a fourth, a record fourth championship. And Giorgio Maggi has damage as well. His tyre has gone down by the looks of it, or his suspension has failed. Either way, he couldn't turn into turn two. And his race is also over. The chequered flag is being ready this time, and Lemery takes a historic victory in Euro NASCAR Pro, the oldest ever winner in Euro NASCAR Pro. But Alan Day is a four time NASCAR Wheel and Euro Series champion. He is a record breaker once more. And Alan Day celebrates with PK Car Sport. It's a record fourth title for the ever-dominant Alan Day. Will he come back and look to make it five in 2023? We know he has the intention to do so, but it's going to be more competition and more excitement in 2023. So he is with Alan, winner, and winner of the Central Chips. How is it? <laughs> How is it? I won the, another, uh, another European Championship. It's an amazing feeling, I think all-time winner, uh, four-time championship, uh, all-time uh, wins, all-time pole positions. I have to say a lot of uh, thanks to, to PK Car Sport. I feel like I'm half Belgian now, although I'm Israeli, but I feel like I'm half Belgian and uh, they deserve it more, more than me and yeah, it's just just amazing feeling. So it was a pretty hectic race. How do you feel about it? Because a lot of safety car, a lot of local cushion and stuff, so... I knew where I need to finish to be the champion. Jimmy drove an amazing race. He really drove an amazing race, I have to say. I have to give him the credit for that. Uh, he managed to go from P4 to P1. And... Uh, yeah, it's uh, karma in my opinion, but he will be a champion one day, no doubt about it. And for now it's over, finally, so what is the goal for the next season? I don't know, I go for a honeymoon now with my wife, I promised her uh, to go to a honeymoon. We got married like half a year ago, but I said like, ah, I need to race, I need to race, no honeymoon. So Time now, to enjoy. Time to enjoy and then I will See think about think about the future yeah exactly thank you Ellen thank you very much thank you